vote. Lapsing is A-OK. -okay. If you can hear my voice and you understand these rules, can I get a big thumbs up? Awesome, that's more than half the boat. Thank you, folks. We're starting off this tour right here on the left with Rocky, the water buffalo. At over six feet tall, he weighs over 350 pounds. That's because he was built using 310,000 Lego bricks. Rocky also has a son. Does anybody know what Rocky says to his son before he leaves for work? He says, bye, son. Over on the right-hand side, behind those rocks, is everyone's favorite mama and papa tortoise, Bob and Gertrude. They've been patiently waiting for their eggs to hatch for the past 24 years. I don't know about you folks, but that just seems a little excessive. Across these waters, you have our newest addition here at Coast Cruise, the Rainbow Elephant. Built out of over 254,000 Lego bricks. Now, if you're sitting in a gray row, please prepare to get wet. And if you're on the left, prepare to be soaked. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm just kidding, folks. Oh my gosh, Sorry. My humor's a little dry sometimes. Around this corner, you're going to meet my best friend, Elsie the Elephant. She's over seven feet tall and was built using 280,000 Lego bricks. Many people think that's water coming out of her trunk, but it's not. Uh-oh. Looks like our original dinosaur construction crew has all gone on break, leaving their friend all alone up there. Hope he doesn't let go. Now, if you're looking up on top of the hill, that's where we have the Duplo Playground, a place for the kids to play. And we'll also go on the Kid Power Tower and the Legoland Express. It's a great little area for your kids to run around and play while your parents relax. Ow. Who am I kidding? Parents never relax. <laughs> We're entering into London, England, where we have both the Elizabeth Tower and the London Eye. A fun fact about that Elizabeth Tower, the bell inside is called Big Ben. That London Eye was built out of over 55,000 Lego bricks. Now you might be checking your watch to see if that time is accurate. It is, two times a day. Please ensure that all little ones are fully seated at all times throughout the tour. And they must keep their hands inside the boat. Straight ahead here we have the Lionsgate Bridge of Canada. Each of those lines on the bridge in front of you have been built out of over 17,000 Lego bricks each. And no folks, I'm not lying about that one. Now here at the Coast Cruise we like to call this bridge the Waffle Bridge. And if you don't get that joke, it just went right over your head. We're entering into India, where we have the Taj Mahal. Now, the real Taj Mahal was built back in the 17th century, and it took 22,000 workers 20 years to create. Ours didn't take nearly as long. That's because it's built out of over 143,000 Lego bricks. That's far less bricks than the real one, so we like to call this the Taj Mahal. It's not quite Taj Mahal. Sailing away from India, we're going to be entering into Paris, France, where we have the Eiffel Tower. Now, the real Eiffel Tower was built back in 1889, stands over 1,000 feet tall, and weighs over 10,000 tons. Ours isn't nearly so tall or heavy. It's only 17 feet tall, but it is built out of over 117,000 Lego bricks. And if you look up to the very top, you get a real Eiffel. Here we have the amazing Lego Falls, built out of a grand total of zero Lego bricks. And our last stop in this world tour is going to be Mount Rushmore, where we have all four faces made out of over 230,000 Lego bricks. 
We have George Washington, Abraham Lincoln, Theodore Roosevelt, and Thomas Jefferson. Please make sure that you're keeping your hands inside the boat at all times. Do not be leaning over the sides of the rail. What's the matter, George? Afraid to fall What? Come on, George. Don't you have a backbone? Those people are listening. Quit picking on George. Oh, come on, Lincoln. Where's your sense of humor? It's been four score and seven years since you said something funny, Teddy. And it'll be seven score and four years until you do again. Just ignore them, George. Was anyone able to spot those two hidden presidents on top of the monument? We're entering into Miniland USA, where we have many cities like the New like New York, San Francisco, New Orleans, Las Vegas, Washington, D.C., Los Angeles, and now San Diego. We have other attractions like the Golden Gate Bridge, the Brooklyn Bridge, the Manhattan Bridge, World Trade Center 1, the Empire State Building, and the Statue of Liberty. The Statue of Liberty is over 6 feet tall and was built using 122,000 Lego bricks. Behind her is the New York Manhattan skyline, built out of over 8 million Lego bricks. All in all, our master builders have used over 60 million Lego bricks to create Miniland USA, an amazing attraction to visit if you have not yet. You must be fully seated at all times. Do not have your heads over the side of the rail. Please ensure that your children are fully seated at all times. Making our way back to the Waffle Bridge, how about a waffle joke? What do you call a waffle that you dropped in the sand? A San Diego. Here we have the many New England Coast Harbor Line. Please keep all hands inside the boat at all times. Uh-oh. Looks like Gulliver's having some heart troubles up ahead. Ah, don't worry about Gulliver, folks. Nothing a little plastic surgery can't fix. Mm -hmm. uh, plastic surgery. Now, making our way to the end of the tour, being greeted up by the resident octopus band. Built out of over 288,000 Lego bricks, they have special guest stars Paul McSharkney on the guitar with Ringo Starfish on those clams. They're playing in an octopus's garden for you Beatles fans. Oh. Now folks, it's been my absolute pleasure to be your guide here at Coast Cruise. Please remain seated at all times until we come to this full and complete stop at the dock. Once we have stopped, then you may step up on those seats, grab that blue handrail, and escape out to the left. Don't forget any items that you may have brought along with you, and yes, that includes your children. Have a wonderful rest of your day here at Legoland, California, where everything is awesome. And I do have one last joke for any mind readers on the boat.